Hey everyone, and welcome to Top Think. Today we're going to learn about 10 things people do when they're attracted to you. Now let's begin. Number 1. Unconscious Alteration If someone finds you attractive, they may want you to feel the same attraction to them. They want to capture your attention so they go out of their way to increase their physical appeal. Now most of the time, that means changing the way they look. Someone who is attracted to you will wear flattering outfits and they'll style their hair to accentuate their best physical qualities. But other people will use behavioral cues to make themselves more appealing. Men, for example, will puff out their chest around women they find attractive. Now, This behavior makes them look more masculine, which can increase their level of attraction. So whether someone changes the way they look or the way they behave, this person is drawing attention to themselves for a reason. They want you to be looking at them, and they're hoping you like what you see. Number 2. Behind the Eyes Which part of your body sends the strongest romantic signals? Well, the eyes are the most common indicators of romantic attraction. Why? Because your gaze is unconsciously drawn toward people you find attractive. If someone you like walks into a room, you automatically look in their direction. In other words, when you look, how you look and where you look are all signs of attraction. If someone likes you, they'll steal furtive glances, they'll stare a little bit too long, and they'll make excuses to look in your direction. These are several different ways that your eyes communicate attraction, but we need to talk about the most significant, and that is eye contact. When you make eye contact with someone, you're showing interest, openness, and curiosity. By holding someone's gaze for more than a few seconds, you're sending a powerful message, and this person has your undivided attention. But the meaning of prolonged eye contact goes even deeper. When you stare into the eyes of someone you're attracted to, you may feel a sense of emotional depth. You may feel vulnerable, nervous, or love-struck. You may experience a strong physical connection that quickens your heartbeat or it makes you smile. So if you want to know if someone is attracted to you, ask yourself this. What does it feel like when your eyes meet? If you look deep into someone's eyes and it makes you feel nervous or overwhelmed, then you too may have a strong physical connection. Number 3. Vocal Variants Your voice plays an important role in physical attraction. People are drawn to specific voices based on the pitch, the volume, and the unique timbre of their vocal tones. Some voices are grating and unappealing, others are charming or irresistible. While most vocal preferences are unique to everyone, there are some patterns that we can accurately measure. For example, in a 2014 study from the journal Evolution and Human Behavior, men unconsciously lowered the pitch of their voice when speaking to people they found attractive. Often, a lower voice indicates a more dominant and confident presence, which made their voice more attractive to female listeners. In other words, if someone finds you attractive, they may vary the pitch of their voice. They want to appeal to your ears because they're hoping for a physical connection. They want you to enjoy the sound of their voice because this person thinks you're attractive. Number 4. Romantic Gravity If someone is physically attracted to you, they may invade your personal space. They'll find opportunities to get closer to you, they'll lean toward you, they'll sit beside you, and they'll close the physical gap between your body and their own. Alright, let's say you're on a date with someone you like and you want to know if it's going well. Is this person genuinely attracted to you? Do you have a chance to take things further? Well, to answer these questions, just pay attention to the distance between you. Are the two of you gravitating together, getting closer and closer every time? Is your date leaning towards you even if you're sitting across the table? It's often easier to look at the position of a specific body part instead of the whole body. For example, this person may be sitting in the same place, but their hands are outstretched, their legs are tangled in yours, in other words, some part of their body has entered your personal bubble. So if you notice any of these changes, this person is attracted to you, whether they realize it or not. Most people don't make these changes on purpose. Instead, they gradually gravitate closer to you. Well, just imagine you're the sun at the center of the solar system, and this person is a planet caught in your gravity. They just cannot keep themselves from drifting closer to you because this person finds you irresistible. Number 5. The Golden Glow 
When you like someone, your body does something really strange. Your skin begins to glow, almost like you're radiating a faint golden light. Now, of course, your skin isn't glowing. While it looks like your skin is turning gold, it's reflecting light from your environment, creating a unique sheen. But why is your skin more reflective than normal? And what does light have to do with physical attraction? Well, the answer isn't as glamorous as it sounds. You're reflecting light because your skin is secreting more oil in the form of sweat. Your sweat sits on the top of your skin and creates a more reflective surface. In other words, you're glowing because you're nervous and sweaty. And when do we get nervous and sweaty? When someone we like is sitting right in front of us. So if someone is glowing, it means you make them nervous. Your presence puts their body into overdrive and their pores create a shiny layer of sweat. Yeah, it isn't always a pretty sight, but someone who sweats around you finds you attractive. Number 6. Comforting Cues Attraction is a tricky feeling, and sometimes it messes with your head. Alright, let's say you're spending time with someone you like, and even though you like this person, spending time with them is taxing on your brain. It makes you anxious, it creates stress, and it makes you uncomfortable in your own skin. So how do you know if someone is attracted to you? Look for self-soothing behaviors like hand rubbing and other kinds of fidgeting. If you see these nervous cues, this person may be extra anxious around you. They can't relax when you're in the room. They're hopelessly attracted to you and it's driving them crazy. Number 7. Dynamic Contact Physical contact has many uses. Some are comfortable and polite, others are intimate and tender. But how do you tell the difference between a professional touch and a romantic one? Well, just think about the difference between a handshake and a hug. Shaking hands is a formal greeting that establishes physical contact without crossing any intimate boundaries. A hug, on the other hand, requires full body contact. Giving someone a hug is much more intimate. That's why we shake hands with strangers while we hug friends and partners. In a romantic context, like a date, physical touch becomes even more dynamic. Instead of formal greetings like handshakes and hugs, someone who finds you attractive may use physical contact to demonstrate their feelings. They'll start with something safe like a handshake or a touch on the arm, but if their attraction deepens, their touches may become more personal. They'll put their hand on your lower back, they'll place their arm around your shoulders or touch your leg with theirs. Escalating touches indicate an increasing level of attraction. In other words, this person is using physical contact to deepen your physical relationship. If you want the same thing, all you have to do is return the favor. Number 8. Biological Attraction What other biological signals demonstrate love or attraction? Alright, let's say you're talking to someone you just met. You saw them from across the room and you summon the courage to start a conversation. Now you're wondering if they find you attractive. Look at the color of their skin, specifically their cheeks. Are they pink and flushed? Did their face turn red the moment you said hello? When you're experiencing strong emotions like excitement or attraction, your body releases a flood of adrenaline. Adrenaline triggers dilation in your blood vessels. Dilation allows more blood and oxygen to flow into your skin, especially sensitive areas like your cheeks, your neck, and your chest. When blood rushes to a specific part of your skin, it turns pink, a common phenomenon we call blushing. So if someone blushes around you, they're feeling a strong emotion like pleasure or nervousness. In either case, their body is reacting to you because they find you biologically attractive. Number 9. Lack of Focus Does this person have a hard time staying focused? Does it feel like they're barely listening? Most of the time, poor listening skills are a bad sign. If someone seems distracted, you may think they're bored, but sometimes a lack of focus is a sign of something deeper. Alright, let's say you're talking to someone who has a huge crush on you. Throughout your conversation, their brain is going haywire. It's overwhelmed by questions, hypotheticals, and nervous thoughts. They desperately want to make a good impression on you. They worry about what you're thinking or what to say next and their anxiety distracts them from the actual conversation. It feels like they don't care, but that couldn't be further from the truth. They're unfocused and overwhelmed because they want nothing more than a stronger connection with you. Number 10. Reflective Happiness 
Do they laugh when you laugh? Do they smile when you smile? If someone is attracted to you, they act like a mirror reflecting your emotions back at you. If someone finds you attractive, they may experience a deeper emotional connection. They may feel a greater sense of empathy towards you because they're personally invested in what you think and feel. Maybe they laugh at a joke they didn't understand. They might smile just because you're smiling. But whatever the reason, this person is happy when you're happy because they find you attractive. Hey, thank you for watching Top Think and be sure to subscribe because more incredible content is on the way.